Here, scientists have found the perfect preservative for fossilized remains, the tar pit. The viscous asphalt oozes up from petroleum seeps miles below. The pools resemble freshwater ponds, but they can ensnare an animal that comes too close. In Venezuela, scientists have only just started excavating this set of tar pits hoping they'll find evidence of North American creatures that migrated south. But working conditions are extreme. Temperatures here typically push to 120 degrees. Humidity is intense. The ground isn't even solid underfoot. Not only is the air temperature sweltering, but the tar pits are hot as well. So you have the heat from the sun and heat radiating from the tar, so it's overwhelmingly hot. Despite the challenge, the excavators have learned how to make sense of this muck and mire. Extracting ancient fossils, steeping in asphalt for 25,000 years. The asphalt, in effect, pickles the bones, stops the decomposition, and allows their identities to come to light. And that's what paleontologist Ascanio Rincón is counting on. When we find these fossils in the tar, they're telling us important things about the Great American Interchange. It means there's been contact from the north. In other words, animals coming from the north and eating animals that are in the south. Several feet down in the tar, Rincón discovers a bone. It's a Big bone, a mastodon femur. The thigh bone of a stegomastodon, one of the largest mammals ever to walk this land. The elephant-like beast originated in North America some 10 million years ago. But it's turned up thousands of miles to the south and hundreds of generations later, living in Venezuela. The tar has preserved the mastodon bone, but it's still quite fragile. A plaster jacket ensures the bone is safe on the trip from the field to the lab. It will join a growing collection of fossils, all confirming that North American prey animals migrated to South America when the continents joined. And they weren't alone. Where prey went, predators followed. Tracking close behind, some of North America's fiercest carnivores, saber-toothed cats.